Welcome in everybody. I'm going to do a quick tutorial on putting a different image on the front and back of a plane. Um, I have been doing a lot lately with paper, you know, folding paper, wadding up paper, rolling paper up, uh, like a map or a scroll, and I want to have a different image on the front and back of my plane. And I just want to show you uh, real quick how I do that. So with a new project, I'm going to hit 7 to go into top view. I'm going to do shift A add a mesh plane and I am going to scale that on the x-axis uh, by 2 so just SX2 and enter uh, I am going to go into shading and I'm going to add a new shader uh, I'm going to hit shift A go to texture I want to do an image texture and I am going to put that into base color I'm gonna go to my desktop where I have this map picture and I'm gonna go ahead and clean this up a little bit so I'm gonna change this side over here to the UV editor I am going to open up that exact same image and scale it out just a little bit go over here go into edit mode and go back over to my UV editor. I'm gonna hit A to select all, and I'm just gonna scale that guy down so that my image is there. Um, and then what you'll see is if I come back over here, go back into object mode, and I go and flip this over, it's the same image on both sides. So what I wanna do is I'm gonna Shift A and add another image texture and I am going to select uh, just a plain parchment uh, that I have and I'm going to uh, delete this principal BF, uh, BSDF I'm going to shift A and I'm going to look for a uh, mix shader and I want uh, the image I want to be on the front to go to the top shader, the image I want on the back to go to the bottom shader. Uh, if you'll notice though when I do this uh, it's still the same image on both sides. So I'm going to add a geometry node and I'm going to use this back facing and I'm going to use it into the factor and now you'll see uh, the one image is on the front and then the plain parchment on the back so that's how I do front and back if you have a better way of doing that please tell me in the comments because I'm always looking to learn I appreciate if you would subscribe I'm just trying to share what I'm learning as I go through I'll have a tutorial coming out soon uh, on how to roll up a map or a scroll and I hope it'll be helpful but if you would Hit subscribe and, and comment if there's a better way to do this. I, I'm willing to learn from you guys.